the ladies and gentlemen, I want to talk about dreams. Dreams. I've had a lot of dreams. I'm a very... For me, I think every man and woman, whatever, has their own religion. And everyone has their own spirituality deep within. And uh, it's the weirdest parts about you. It's what we would term insanity. And it's so weird that you don't tell anyone about it. Unless you get a little stupid. Or if you just don't care and you're confident about it like I am. But I think the ones that uh, lose control or the ones that get like put in a mental hospital or whatever, the ones that aren't confident, that's my personal opinion. You don't have to agree, but it's pretty true. Now, anyway, I want to get to dream dreams. And dreams are your personal spirituality. And I've had some weird dreams. And I remember 2017. I had a dream, and uh, it's funny how things, how, how, what essentially dreams are is that your mind sees so far into the future, but your subconscious mind, or perhaps even your unconscious mind, but your conscious mind is not able to see as far into the future. Um, your, your subconscious mind, and that's what your task is as a person is to figure out your unconscious mind and when you do then your habits change and then your circumstances change then you find out you're living in a new place new whatever new house new whatever new clothes new money and when you do these things you understand who you are in your dreams I don't trust anyone. <laughs> you know, I don't trust anyone who says they don't have like violent dreams or they've never had a violent dream before. I mean, we've been bred, we've been built for war. You know, mankind has a bloody past, so of course we have negative impulses. It's about dealing with those negative impulses in a in an enlightened way so that they don't control you and the ones that end up in mental hospitals are the ones that don't have this knowledge so when I say divine mental illness I mean understand your mental illness and be conscious of it and have an enlightened divine understanding of it because essentially your religion is within you